Hey doston this is Rahul I hope all of you are fine In this video we are going to learn how to prove 4 is equal to 5 My dear friend this is very simple let's start Consider 4 is equal to 4 this is absolutely right expression 4 is equal to 4 Now I'm trying to manipulate this expression in different ways If I subtract 24 from 4 I'll have to subtract from left hand side and right hand side both Now I get minus twenty is equal to minus twenty. This is also right. Now minus twenty can be written as twenty-five minus forty-five, and minus twenty can also be written as sixteen minus thirty-six. No problem. Twenty-five can be written as five square. Forty-five can be written as nine into five. In the same way, sixteen can be written as four square, and thirty-six can be written as nine into four. Now, I'm writing nine as nine by two into two. That means the same as I have done in the left hand side. As uh, the same has been done on the right hand side as well. Now I'm trying to add eighty one by four, which is equal to nine by two whole square on both the side. That means left hand side and right hand side. I'll be getting five square minus nine by two into two into five. Plus nine by two whole square. I have added this to the left hand side. The similar thing will be done on the right hand side as well. So here we are adding plus nine by two whole square. Now we know that a minus b whole square. This is a mathematical algebraic formula. A minus b whole square is equal to a square minus two ab plus b square. And in our expression, if I compare this formula. With our expression, I'll get a is equal to five, and b is equal to nine by two. So I can transform this equation in the form of a minus b whole square. I would be getting five minus nine by two whole square. In the same way, I can transform the right hand side as well. I would get. 4 minus 9 by 2 whole square. Since I have got squares on both the sides of the element, we can take the square root and we can cancel the squares as well. Now, I'll be getting 5 minus 9 by 2 is equal to 4 minus 9 by 2. Once this is done. I have minus nine by two on the right hand side and left hand side. I can cancel both the nine by two, and uh, followed by I'll be left with five is equal to four. Oh wow, this is amazing! What a pleasant surprise! Five is equal to. We started with four is equal to four. Now we've got five is equal to four. How amazing it was! Every step was correct. Then how can we get this surprise? Hmm? If you don't understand what is the mistake in this thoroughly, please subscribe our channel. In the next video, I'll be letting you know what's the problem in this. As of now, thank you very much for watching this video, and please stay tuned and like this video.